Here is a nice little pink square, and I, I'm pretty sure already you could tell the diagnosis. But let's blow it up anyway for the uh, human beings that are in the group as well. It's getting bigger, 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 bigger. At least from this stage, you could probably suspect this could be something like brain. Now you know it's brain because you see glial cells. Um, perhaps you see occasional neurons as well, like here, probably here, or maybe a couple over here. Most of these smaller round cells are glial cells. Big deal, normal brain, let's move on. Well, let's, let's not move on. The first thing that you could see is that these blood vessels are usually pretty prominent and common. Perhaps they're a little more prominent and common than usual. All these little red streaks, whether they're oval or round or hot dog shaped, are pretty prominent, like maybe there's some general congestion. Also noted that as we look at some of these blood vessels, not only are they perhaps congested, but some of them have a little cuff of cells surrounding them, especially the bigger blood vessels, like here, and like here, like here. This is not normal. There is a hypothetical space in the blood vessels of the brain, even small blood vessels, but more so in big ones, called the virchow robin space. And in inflammatory encephalitis, often caused by viruses, whether they're arthropod-borne viruses or non-arthropod-borne viruses, whether they are uh, viruses that normally attack the brain or perhaps viruses that attack the brain in immunocompromised hosts. Whenever you see a blood vessel in a brain, that is cuffed, C-U-F-F-E-D, by these normal looking lymphocytes. This is what they call vir uh, lymphocytic cuffing in the virchow robin space. You can guess that there is an encephalitis going on and more often than not, it's viral and it's nonspecific. It could be any virus. It could be other things as well. We saw a case of syphilis that had it. But uh, lymphocytic cuffing around blood vessels, virchow robin space, anywhere in the brain, viral encephalitis until proven otherwise. Thank you very much.